You know, to paraphrase a very wise New Yorker, they're up and they're stuck. Welcome back to Style Trial, the series where we test out celebrity brands and trends. I'm Page Six Style Editor Alana, and today we're pushing things to the next level. Our brave Page Six staffers have tested out Skin's shapewear, swimwear, and even bras before, but today it's all about the new ultimate push-up bra. Kim Kardashian has built her latest launch as a boob job in a bra and it was created using 3D scans and molds of real women's breasts, including her own. Unlike traditional push-up bras, which use one large foam pad and can come off looking kind of shelf-like, the Ultimate Bra uses more natural teardrop-shaped padding and is made from soft, smooth microfiber. I am wearing a 32B, which is my usual size, and I would say it fits pretty well. I maybe could have gotten away with a 34, and actually on Skim's site, it recommends that if you're in between band sizes that you go up, which I think is a really wise recommendation. Amazingly, I have never worn a push-up bra before. This is my first. So I can't really say or speak to how it compares to other push-up bras on the market. Um, what I will say is that it's pretty comfortable. I was kind of expecting, I mean, I didn't really know what to expect, but I was envisioning more of like an auga effect, like super dramatic in your face, kind of maybe cheesy a little, which is why I've shied away from push-up bras in the past. But I have to say, I think it's a pretty natural look. I think the fabric is really soft and smooth and nice. Um, I like how it feels against my skin. As a proud member of the Itty Bitty Titty Committee, I am not used to having much in the way of cleavage, and this bra definitely gives me a boost um, that I'm not used to having. But again, it's not like shelf-like. It doesn't feel bulky or really in your face. I would actually wear it, which is saying something. I probably wouldn't replace my everyday lightly lined bra with this, but I could see myself pulling it out for a special occasion. I ordered this in the 36D. Um, I'm very glad that I did because it's providing a lot more coverage that I would normally get. The band size fits really well. If I would have gone down a size, my usual 34, I think it would have been giving spillage. I don't think that I would have enjoyed it as much, but I love the way that it fits. Um, I'm not pouring out of it. I love the material that Skims uses. It's super buttery soft. It doesn't feel like it's gonna cling to anything that I wear. And yeah, it's just super comfortable, honestly. Every time Skims comes out with something different, I wanna be a hater and I just can't because it just, it just like makes you look good. Kim knows what she's doing. This feels good, it looks good. I would have to say that this is one of the best push-up bras I've probably tried. So I am in a 38D and you know, to paraphrase a very wise New Yorker, they're up and they're stuck. I'm not mad at all, it's giving like, Dolly, comma, part, and not too much though. Like, you know, like it's enough. And I, I'm very particular about my bras because like these are some of the hardest working ladies in the business. So like I wanna clothe them appropriately. Like they need to like, I'm like hide them under a bushel. No, like I'm gonna let them shine. And this bra definitely like lets them shine. I've had other push-up bras in the past. And I mean, they've given like up under my chin, like, you know, pillows at summer camp. But thankfully this one is like enough that I'm not gonna offend any clergymen if I'm like walking down the street. It gives the lift, it's not too much. I'm gonna like bring the boys to the yard, but it's not gonna be like creepy, you feel me? Okay ladies, last thing. Skims claims that this bra is seamless, disappears under clothing, no quadra boob. Shall we put that to the test?